Good morning, guys. I want to do a Big Brother Episode 1 recap. So the beginning of Episode 1 is always the same. We have an introduction to each house guest. Typically, they do this four at a time. This episode, they did eight and eight for a total of 16 castmates. Next, Julie told the housemates that a few nights ago, there was a break-in. And we see on video, Brittany... Danielle and Frankie break into the house with a time machine because they want to go back to their seasons that they should have won. Of course, with Big Brother, something horribly went wrong and it changed the house forever. And now we are living in the multiverse of the Big Brother house. Julie lets the castmates go in the house four at a time. And I just want to talk about America being the first in the house. Will the first person in the house get the first house curse? And if you are unaware of that, every season we pay attention to who walks in first because they don't win. The one exception to this was one of the seasons um, that Nicole had actually won. Did she break the curse or is it going to happen again? Next, we get a shot of the backyard because Julie told the first four they're going to go into the backyard. They're each going to pick a different spot on the back floor games and they have to sit on the color she had told them. I believe the first group was pink. So let's get into the games. The first game was played right here on the bottom. They had to run across with a newspaper that was in different like Tetris shapes and place it in the box at the end and it could only fit a certain way. Chloe, Jane, America, and Nicole were the first three, so Jared became one of the first nominees. There's no HOH in this game, First four are nominees. Second game was played upstairs there and it was a, like an exercise machine with a giant boot on the end and you had to hit yourself in the butt 100 times to get to the end. Kirsten did not make it out of that one so she is our second nominee. Third game was also played upstairs in the left corner and that was some kind of science game they had to connect wires to their goo meter and they had to blow up their goo on them to stay safe and felicia was our nominee from that game now our final game was a scary game right here the contestants were being held by a giant hand and they had little uh, rocks on the end to hang on to the hand was trying to pull them into the nether world and they had to hang on for a dear life Cody was our nominee there and he also got pulled into the netherworld and we are not we were told we don't know when he'll come back. We then cut to a commercial break and Big Brother shows us the kitchen where Saray from Survivor is pouring herself a glass of champagne and if you don't know her son Jared is in the house and he is now one of the nominees. That basically concluded the episode, and as always, you know how Julie likes to tell us, expect the unexpected. How will the multiverse of Big Brother change the game this season? I'm excited to watch. I'm excited to see. I'm hoping for a great season. So far, every one of the castmates seems like a great person. No one, There was not one person that I wanted to say, that one needs to go home first, which is kind of out of the ordinary for me. I did catch some live feeds last night. I will do a recap of that once I get home. I'll try to fish out any information that I missed while I was asleep.